Hello everyone, I am Vishali and in this lesson from my course Falling In With Amino Acids, I am going to talk about one of the 20 standard amino acids which is isoleucine. So if we have to introduce isoleucine in a short paragraph, we can say that it is one of the essential amino acids which is needed for hemoglobin formation and it also stabilizes and regulates the blood sugar and energy levels. So it is one of the most important amino acids if we talk about the hemoglobin and blood circulation homeostasis inside our body. Besides it, this is the chemical formula for isoleucine. It contains a hydrocarbon side chain which is isobutyl or secondary butyl in nature and it can be interpreted as ILE and one letter code is I and these are all the codons which are genetically coded or genetically coded for isoleucine. Besides that, this is the molecular structure of isoleucine. This is how it looks like and it is an alpha amino acid which is used to synthesize protein and it is an essential amino acid meaning that it cannot be synthesized in our body and we have to take foreign or you can say food material or a foreign source of isoleucine inside our body to maintain a proper level of isoleucine in order to maintain proper body functioning. Besides that, it is non-polar and aliphatic in nature. If we talk about sources, then animal sources mainly include fish food and meat, eggs, cheese, beef and all of those non-vegetarian food substances which we normally consume. And if we talk about the vegetable sources, then it mainly includes cabbage, spinach and all of the green leafy vegetables. Functions of isoleucine and benefits mainly include that it prevents muscle protein breakdown when we exercise. Besides that, isoleucines are valuable for athletes because they enhance energy, increase endurance and aid in the healing and repair of muscle tissue. So if there is a breakdown of muscle tissue inside our body, then isoleucine is an amino acid which will be there present, present there for proper healing and fast healing of the muscle. Besides that, it aids healing and it uh, increases the endurance for athletes and uh, all of those who have larger consumption of energy. Besides that, it is also converted in liver to blood sugar. Therefore, it can be helpful in maintaining proper blood glucose level and that's why it is also useful for athletes because whenever there is a need of glucose or strong energy, then it can be useful or it can be useful in increasing blood glucose levels. Besides that, isoleucine is also needed in children for their growth. So, if any children or uh, any child is deficient in isoleucine, then the proper muscle growth will not be seen and deficiency can often lead to various type of muscular and homeostatic disorders which are very very dangerous for child. So thank you guys this was all about isoleucine you can follow it and share for the recent updates by Mu and Academy. Thanks.